you have okay. this meeting I will, is being recorded i will uh, send a message right oh okay thank you okay what happened what message <laughs> <laughs> Good evening, teacher. How are you? Hi, how are you? It's a copy of the... Very happy. <laughs> Very good. You're happy today. Why? Why is that? Well, because, well, thanks, God, we're happy. Very good. Another day, another dollar. Another dollar, yeah. <laughs> that's very, that's a popular saying, you know, Hey, how are you? Uh, you know, I'm okay. Another day, another dollar. It's like saying. Oh. <laughs> I haven't Good heard evening. that. Good evening. Good evening. Good yes, evening. It's, a, it's an expression. What do you think that expression is? Um, pasándola. Yes. Oh, como por lo menos tengo trabajo, you know, like, no, ah, good. you know, like stuff, you know, pasando, like, you know, yeah, another day, another dollar. Yes. <laughs> it's hot today. Yes, it is. All day has been hot. Yes, it has been hot all day. Mm -hmm. Very hot. Yes. Hold on, let me open the platform. Hello, Janeth Yanira. Hi, teacher. How are you? I'm okay, thank you. I like I like to say your name, Janeth Yanira. <laughs> when your mother was angry with you, did she always say that? Janeth Yanira, ven y para acá. Uh, uh, something like this. This. Oh, they called you Yaya, correct? You told me. No, she never called me uh, in this form. She always um, called me like Janet because uh, this name actually isn't the, the one of she wants for me. But my dad forgot the, the number she said and he called me <laughs> um, this way. Really? Yeah. <laughs> your, your father forgot, so he called it. Oh, fathers. Yeah. So, oh, oh. The story, the story result like this. Mm -hmm. You know, a long time ago, I remember I used to teach in my class some people from like Aldea, from City Hall. Yeah. City Hall. City Hall. And they told me that inside City Hall, they have like a special book of strange names. Mm -hmm. You know, like strange names, you know, and como Eo y este, como like um, Usnavi, Onescent. Mm -hmm. Pero oh, yeah, I, those are not permitted anymore. But you know what Usnavi is? No. No. U.S. Navy. U.S. Navy. Mm. Yeah, so I imagine people in that time, the Usnavi, hey, I like that. <laughs> Or on a cent, one cent. On a cent. On a cent. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes. Teacher. Yes. On the time, one of my friends that who work in the Alcaldia mm -hmm. me that say me that there are many boys uh, call it Najib. <laughs> really? I'm, I'm not surprised. <laughs> yeah. Or, or Lionel. Let's see. Yes, yes. Lionel. 
because of Messi or Nayib Bukele or Ah, uh, Yo le quería poner en broma a mi, a mi esposa, le hice una broma. Cuando fui a nombrar a mi hijo, le dije que le había puesto Poncius Pilatus. <risa> y, <risa> y, y, uh, y no, mentira, solo Poncius. Oh, my, no, no, please, please. <risa> But no. No, le quería poner Bono. Ok. For you too, you know, Bono. <laughs> hey, what's up, Rafael? How are you? Hey, thank you. And you? I'm I'm cool. I'm all right. Rafael, I have a question for you. Okay, tell me. Do you still eat chicken? Yes. Really? You I still like it? Yes, I you still st eat chicken. I, I like the chicken. I have friends that or people that um that that they work like in Pollo Campero. Yes. And they tell me that they can't they can't even smell. <laughs> the, like after so many months or years, they tell me that they can't even they hate the smell or they don't eat chicken anymore. Really? Yes. No, I like the chicken. Every every form cook. No, but I'm I'm talking about the chicken in your business and where you work. Yes, I, I I like the chicken too. Oh, okay. Because it's a different f flavor. Oh yeah, you have different flavors. Yes. I was uh, my friend that she worked in the in the in the airport. She told me that the uh, airlines. Huh? Hold on one moment. She told me that the airlines, they they it came to a point that they they talked to Pollo Campero and they told them, "Hey, do something about the smell," <laughs> because I mean the smell is not bad; it's good. I mean it's no. it's food, mm -hmm. but they were so sick of smelling Pollo Campero for ten hours, for many right. months, many mm -hmm. years. So that's why the bags of Pollo Campero in the airport are sealed. Uh huh. Like a zip. Yeah, there's uh huh. Like it's because the airlines told them stop. <laughs> because uh, people they go, hey, give me fifty pieces, give me one hundred, give me twenty. Right. Mm -hmm. So yeah, she told, so that's why <laughs> that's why now they are sealed. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Let me open the the platform. I have a good history about uh, Pollo Real. Uh, one uh -huh. thing, he, he, it was... Uh, I'm sorry, Patricia, Patricia, one thing. It's not history, it's story. Story, story. okay, story. sorry. No, no, it's okay, uh, but you know the difference, history and story, right? Yes, yes. Okay. And it was January 1st, we went to Chalatenango from my husband's family and uh, uh, we uh, we passed to Pollo Real to have breakfast because it's um, about 7 a.m. and we 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 know there that the the breakfast um, uh, if we we buy one breakfast, uh, they uh, the pollo real bring us one uh, breakfast more uh, on free. I don't if you understand me. So it's two for the price of one. Yes. 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 And yes. 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 Repeat. We said. <laughs> Repeat it. We know that the yeah. breakfast is two for the price of one. We noticed the breakfast it was two for the price of one. Good. Oh, really? And we said, oh, really? Yes. Uh, entonces, 
see, we were uh, four persons, uh, so we only pay to breakfast. Mm -hmm. Even okay. though, Patricia, <laughs> is it still? Say, I know. I know a Rafael Dabu, you get an extra discount. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> no. <laughs> Rafael, is it still two for one? Yes, it's still. Every day? Every day. Really? Oh. Really. Hey, that's good to know. AM to 10, 30 a.m. You know what? In my anniversary and my wife's birthday, I'm going to invite her to to breakfast and i'm going to pretend i don't know <laughs> so i said you know what baby let's, let's go to pollo real let's go I, the, the breakfast oh look two for one i didn't know that <laughs> <laughs> hey from seven to ten it's, hey good, it's good too cheap. oh okay wait wait let, let me let me tell you the difference between two and very uh, okay do you understand when you said it's too cheap and very cheap no. Okay. Yeah, um, demasiado. Yeah. What, what is the difference between two, bastante y demasiado? Uh -huh. Do you know what the difference is? Okay. Imagine. Check this out. A, my, me vende un carro. My, my friend, he's selling me a car. It's a Toyota 2020, a Corolla. It's very beautiful. He wants $2,000. Do you think it's good? Very good. <laughs> it's, but it's, it's amazing. It's, yeah. Yes. It's crazy. <laughs> okay, so it's a little suspicious, no? Right. Yeah. So it's not very cheap. It's too cheap. Yeah. Okay. Yes, so yeah. when you say two, it indicates a problem. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, okay. 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 Maybe not a big problem. But it is in Spanish, también es igual. O ya saben la diferencia de bastante y demasiado. Mm -hmm. Sí, sí, sí. Mm -hmm. demasiado. Demasiado, it, sí. it's, it's a problem. Ajá. Bastante, it's okay. I mean, it can be something Pasear negative. La or confunde. Yes, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's a very good point. 2020. Yes. Oh. Yeah, but Patricia, but it was an example. <laughs> So you know, <laughs> if, if, if you yes, because, um, my car is two thousand twenty. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, you know, it's so I would tell you, you know what? That's too cheap. I don't think I would. I don't know. That's too cheap. Sí. You know. Yes. Okay. You know, um, I have a student. I'm going to tell you just in case in the future. If you ever buy a car, be careful. Because I have a student that he works in Presto. You know Presto, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Presto is a pawn shop. Yeah. And they that store, they give you money for your car. So let's say, Patricia, if you go to this place to pass Presto and they... Hey, how much money do you give me for my car? They they ask you, do you want to pawn it or, and use it, or you want to the company to keep it and then you pay later? So Patricia, you say no, I want to use it. Oh, okay. You understand me, correct, class? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay. So the the store will tell you, okay, Patricia, we will give you money for your car and you can use it. But the mm -hmm. only condition is that we will put a GPS on your car, but you will pay for that. And that's $300. So Patricia say, oh, okay. So Patricia, you say, okay, so it's a Toyota. They make the evaluation and they give you, I don't know, $6,000. Tafa. Oh no, they give you, let's say, let's say $10,000. Mm -hmm. And you say, okay. So you do the legal paperwork mm -hmm. and they give you the money. Mm -hmm. And they give you the money. 
what happens is that when they give you the money, they don't take your your card. No le pueden quitar el documento because you need it. So the car is still under your name. What the store they do is that they send a letter to a vice ministerio, the transporte, to say that that car está hoy en prenda. But that's a process, it takes like one month. Because in the contract you sign, all the paperwork, they tell you, okay, now you're giving your car to us as a prenda, you know? So what people are doing is they get the money for the car and then that month they sell it. How come? Because, okay, so imagine Sandra, uh, Patricia, imagine, this is not true. This is a situation. So Patricia, her car is, um, Imagine her car is a Toyota 2015 and they gave her $10,000 for that car. And then Sandra, you want to buy it because Patricia is selling that car in $9,000. And Sandra, you say, you know what? I'll give you $5,000. And Patricia says, okay, give me $5,000. Sandra, you think, yes. Yeah. You know, I wow. Did it. Uh -huh. And, you know, you check on, on the email and in, in the web page, and yes, it's, it's proprietario, <laughs> because the paperwork has not been corrected. Uh -huh. So here comes Sandra. You pay her. So now Patricia has $5,000 and the $10,000 from, from, from the store. What happens, Sandra, is that the car belongs to the store. So when the year passes, you know, Sandra, oh, I have to renew my my permit. Isale, oh, está en prenda. What? No, when I bought the car, I used it. No, it's in prenda. Dear me. Uh-huh. <laughs> you know, está en prenda. So you go to the store and the store, this is what my, my student told me. The store tells them, we will not take your car, we won't, but we will not, until you pay us that money, we tell the Visa Ministerio, okay, yes, that's a... Disculpe, alguien me tiene en la compu y en celular, por casualidad. No, I don't. Okay, sorry, okay. I hear echoes. Okay, so... That's that's the big that's the problem in this moment. Wow. So Patricia dijo, yeah. Me dio 10 mil aquí, 15 mil. And she disappears. Claro, Sandra will take action, but you know, the, the, it's a long, long time. So but teacher, but uh, Sandra could be paid the difference to a uh, 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 punch up in order to get a complete price of the car, in this case, I think. Yes, but Sandra will have to pay $10,000 to the pawn shop and the interest. Yeah. Oh, oh my God. God. Wow. <laughs> Oops, no. Well, you know, teacher, um, I have a history of a real, because it is real. Story, story, not history. No, no. Uh -huh. Story, not history. Uh -huh. Just like, um, well, I suppose a story is, is something that is like inventado. No, a story is un, una historia, un cuento, una anécdota. No, no, wait, 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 one moment, one moment, un cuento. You see, in English, story is, hey, les tengo, okay, history is algo like Napoleon Bonaparte, El Salvador, yeah. La Guerra Civil, all that is history, oh. world history, El Salvador history. Oh, mm. right. But when it's like something personal, it's a story. Story, yeah. Well, well, a real story. Uh -huh. <laughs> when we, when my, when my husband and and, and I began our our uh, business of transportation, we had six buses, only buses. But then 
uh, we work for, for TACA International on those days. And uh, uh, TACA said, well, we will not need any more your, your services. And well, anyway, we said, uh, we will find another another enterprises to, to offer our services. But appeared a man that said, I want to buy all your buses. And my husband believed him. And, oh, uh -huh, and, wow. and he, and he uh, gave a little bit money. And then um, the man sold the each each bus to six people, different people. Oh my God. Yes, and the last one uh, was uh, um, the, the signature was, um, what, how do you say? Um, la, la, oh, <laughs> I in Spanish, I don't remember. Um, ah, false, falsificó la firma. De mi falsified, esposa. falsified. Uh -huh. Falsified the, the, the signature. And then the police was looking for my husband because they say that my husband has stolen the last bus. <laughs> so we, we, lost, we lost all the buses, you know. And oh, we are oh paying, and we are still paying $4,000 per month to, to, the, to the banco because uh, they, they gave, uh, gave us the the loan for for buying those buses you know oh my god i'm so sorry and what happened to the man uh, well, he disappeared no well he disappeared but he was arrested <clears throat> and uh, and he was very very friend with the bad people you know yes and and the bad people uh, gave them the money to to go out from from the jail but now, now he is he is oh, um, arrested again. But now is the you know the, the new the new uh, under the new system. In in this new system, he hasn't been able to go out of the jail. He doesn't have friends anymore. <laughs> no, no, but we didn't didn't do any anything because uh, he. Um, um, I mean, so. he threatened. Um, threatened. Uh -huh, he threatened. He threatened my husband, and so we didn't do anything. But well, you know, God made his his justice. You know what? Yes, you know what, Sandra. Congratulations, because you are you you faced it. I yeah. I would have been very very depressed for that much money. Yeah. Oh yes. Yeah. Some people give up. You know, like no, forget it. Yes, <laughs> yes, but well, uh, my husband, uh, he, he believes in God and me too. And, and now we continue working on, uh, but not with, not with buses anymore, but with uh, mini buses and posters. Transportation, okay. Yes. That is your line of business. Yes, that's our line of business. Okay. Remember class, I explained to you what the line of business is, correct? line of business um, it's like the field of business yes like what is your line of business mm -hmm. it's a category size of the, the, the area of work i think a job i don't know let, let me give you let me give an example for example like a speciality okay a call center yeah. a call center has a call center has production it has IT. operations. Service. Service. IT. IT. No, but that, that I think is an operations. It has productions. Productions would be, what was that? They're all call centers. They're all, but production. De verdad, me oigo un eco. No sé si alguien me tiene. Oh, one moment. Hold on. I'm, I'm going to put everybody in mute. Let me see if. Hello, 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 hello. Okay, yeah, no more echo. Hello, creo que era yo con usted porque estoy usando. Okay. Thank you, Daniel. Okay, thank you, Dan. So, 
Produ you know, in a, in a business, production are, of course, maybe salespeople, the people that produce money. Operations, operations would be, uh, no, siempre me oigo el eco. Maybe it's me. Pero soy a menos. Wait, hold well on. Hello, 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 hello. Ah, Beto, I think it was you. Wait. But I don't know why. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello. Yes, no. Beto. Okay, hold on. Daniel, wait, wait, hold on. I only have Beto in this moment. Okay, I hear an echo. Now, Beto, I'm, go I'm going to put you in mute. Hold on. Hello, 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 hello. Oh, yes, it was you, Beto. It was you. <laughs> it but was I don't you. know why. No, I, yeah, sometimes it's, it's the... Sometimes it's the, you know, sometimes it's the microphones. They're, I don't know, it's, it's technology. So, okay, so imagine um, you uh, you want to work in a call center, but people say, oh, you can try a call center. Yes, but what do you want to do? Ah, you can try recursos humanos. Okay, so that is staff administration, correct? Ah, you quiero ventas. Oh, okay, that's up. Uh, that's um. ¿Qué fue lo que le dije que era? Production. 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 So, it's a own line of business. So, when people say, "Oh, I want to work in a call center," okay, what line of business do you want to work? Oh, I want to work in a administration in a in a call center. Oh, okay, so that's your line of business. Manufacturing. Manufactured, I think that would be production. Production. Now, do you do you listen to the echo? No. Or not? No, no more no. echo. Oh, okay. That's a very common, common Example, word. Uh, yes. In a call center, if you don't work for sales, uh, you work for a customer service. And support yeah. of customer service. service is the... The same technical support, technical production? support. Mm, that would be what operations. It's operations. Okay. Yes, production is what produces. You know, okay. like let me give you an example. It's una triste realidad, but imagine my company, you work in my company, and in my company, Jacqueline, Javier, and Walter son ventas. Yes. And Ellos me interesan. Because Miguel, Carlos, and Rafael, they are customer care. Administration or something like that. No, they are they are operations, so they don't generate me money. Yeah. O sea, si lo, in, in business, that's how they see it. I need Walter, Beto, and Jacqueline. They generate me money. Rafael, Carlos, and Miguel... They don't gen, but also, but I need them because part of what I sell, I have to sell support to my clients. Pero Rafael, Carlos, and Miguel, their position doesn't generate me money. They just operate what I sell. Yeah, the same the same case occur on on uh, on my job because um, the people who have um, many. Um, Valor. Value, for, more, more value. Value for the for the uh, gifts are the law the the lawyers because they they have the the treats with the, the with the clients mm -hmm. and all all the the other people like me that only prepare the things and make the 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 work the the. Um, the documents and all, all kind of these kinds of things um, are sobrevalorados. Overrated. Overrated, yeah. Sobre o no uh, valorados? No valorados. No valor, underrated. Underrated, we are underrated. Underrated, yes. It's true, it's, everybody's important in the company. Well, si las ellos, you know, like, oh, everybody's important. And it's true because Janet, Without you, the lawyers wouldn't, you make their life easier. 
Yeah. I mean, everything works together, but remember all the companies, all they want is money, 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 money. Of course. So, but teacher, but the, also yes. there, is a, there is a line called quality. Uh, the, that line uh, is, is in charge of, uh, of monitoring all the, all the colleagues uh, that the other people are receiving and they, and they see here, if, if they speak correctly, yes. they, you know. Mm -hmm. Yes, but there, there is, there is a, yeah, and I think that would be administration because administration would be like accounting, human resources. Yeah. Um, ¿Cómo se llaman los que contratan? Eh. Chasing. No, no, I forgot the name. Human uh Human resources. Humanos, okay. human resources. That, that's human resources, but staff administration. Yeah, administration is all that is human resources. Uh -huh. um, admin uh, accounting. Uh -huh. Customer service. No, eh, eh, no, that's the thing. Si usted va a una empresa, like le di un call center, Rafael, what do you do in Pollo Real? Recrutadores. Oh yeah. yeah, marketer. Okay, you're marketer. I think you are administration then. Yes. Mm -hmm. So I imagine. Okay, so I don't know in your case, Rafael, but in a in a big big company, todos están en un mismo lugar. Ahí es accounting. Oh, es que ahí es administración. And ahí van a estar las oficinas de contabilidad, human resources. ¿Cómo se llama? Si tienen Enfermería. Mm -hmm. Nursery. Nursery, yes. Um, yeah, yeah, si están divididos todos. Okay, ahí, oh, aquí, aquí está, like, production, aquí está operations. So, but uh, everything is important, but that's why when you go to Claro, or when you go, it's, ahí se va viendo lo, las etapas. Mm -hmm. I do that. I do that, and I recommend you to do that. Um. Every time I finish my contract with Claro, I always say I want to stop. See if you like lower. I I tell my wife, look, don't fight with the first person. Cuando uno va a poner queja, you know, pobre, usted habla. Don't fight with him. He will not do anything. He has no power. Be respectful to him and then tell him, please, can I speak with your manager? Escalate. So every time I go to Claro, I say, sí, fíjese que ya terminé mi contrato y quiero. Okay, caballero, no hay problema. You know, like. Or I tell him, eh, ¿cuál teléfono tienen hoy en mi contrato? You know, oh, tenemos este, este para los de usted que es 40 dólares. Tenemos este, like, really? Oh, man. This is like my seventh contract with you. <laughs> you can't give me anything better. No, caballero, fíjese que, oh, okay. Okay, no problem. Um, no, hasta aquí llego. It's okay, but thank you very much. Creo que me voy a quedar preparado con ustedes. Oh, okay, no problem. Y estoy esperando y cabal llega. Excuse me one moment, please. <laughs> Permítame, vamos a ver qué puedo hacer por usted. Oh, yeah. Y viene el otro. Ese se llama retention. Yeah, mm -hmm. retention. Es el mejor vendedor de todos. Exactly. Él interesa vender. Ah, uh -huh. yeah, o sea, his job is, hey, si esta no pudo, you keep, ¿qué tal, cómo está? Yeah, if you just estamos viendo that you have seven contracts with, and I get a much better phone. <laughs> so I recommend you to do that. So yeah. anyways, going back to that, so those are line of business, you know, so. Like, okay, like, I remember before everybody, oh, you quiero trabajar en TACA. Before. Uh, yes. Yeah, but TACA has many things. Okay, yo, eh, quiero Euromoso, Euromosa. I think that would be operations. <laughs> mm -hmm. I worked okay. there uh, at TACA two years ago, 10 years. For 10 wow. years? Yes, I was in the air, uh, the, in the airport. I work as a purchases and uh, basis uh, based on uh, repairs or spare parts, and that's my my 
my job here there. Really? Hey, that's cool. My oh. husband and me also, <laughs> my husband and I also worked for Taka. He was the the payroll, uh, payroll mm. department. But, well, but he was. ASJ, payroll. Yes. Planilla, that's administration. Yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. mm. And I worked at the at the airport. Oh, that's so cool. Did you ever see anybody famous? Oh, yes, of course. Jorge Ortiz de Pinedo, um, the presidents from coming from other countries. The airplane, the, air, the, the, the airplane of uh, Iron, Iron Maiden oh, was amazing. That airplane. Oh, man. <laughs> the, I would <laughs> love to touch. I would have touched that airplane. airplane. <laughs> I would have touched and said, yeah. Oh, yeah. I touched Iron Maiden's airplane. Enormous. <laughs> All right, hey, cool. So uh, um, this is because if you ever work or something related to English, van a ver LOB, that's what it means, line of business. Line of business. Mm -hmm. Walter, mm -hmm. eh, los bancos tienen bastante eso. De, 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 en, ¿En qué ramo? Creo que sería en qué ramo. Yeah. Okay. So we're going to listen to a little story. Okay. I used to have a girlfriend that she worked in Taka. Well, she wasn't like really my girlfriend, but she worked, I think, in the VIP wow. section. Mm -hmm. And sometimes she calls me and she tells me, do you know who is in El Salvador in this moment? And I said, no, who? Bruce Willis. Wow. <laughs> no, really? But sometimes it's only for a stop because they're going to Chile or something. They're going to South America. So they only stay in the VIP. How do you say? Cuando uh, hace uh, escala, perdón. Layover. 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 Excuse me? Stop over. Stop over. No, it's layover. Oh, okay. Lay de recostar, layover. Mm -hmm. So she always calls me, look, Luis Miguel is here, or. Mm -hmm. Pero she, she, uh, the people that work in the VIP, they are strictly, they have very strict rules, like don't talk to them. No mm -hmm. autographs, don't, no pictures, porque por eso es VIP. Mm -hmm. That's right. Yeah. Yo, a mí me hubieran despedido con Iron Maiden. <laughs> Como forget my job. Hey, I love you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. So let me share my screen with you. Listening, listen to the conversations, check the correct answer. Patrick's mom finished high school. Okay, so you see my screen, correct, class? Yes, sir. All right, yes. let's hear it. I think we will not have class next Wednesday, I think. I'm very positive we will not have class. Oh, Why? One. Yeah, because it's uh, November. It's, it's a, ah, yeah, yeah. It's a holiday. I know. Yes, it's a holiday. <laughs> yeah, so keep that in mind. So maybe we will go to Friday. Yes. Probably. Okay. Do you go to the cemetery? I don't. Yes, yes I go. No, I don't. No, I don't. That tradition doesn't exist anymore. Huh? Even no. I know it's a Catholic tradition, but even it's Catholic not. people don't do that anymore. I, I, I noticed that, that that tradition is very, very. You know, that that day um, is my birthday and. Um, You're uh, on November the 2nd. Yes. Oh my God. 
when I was when I was a little kid, my my brothers bullied me. They bullied me a lot. You know, like, oh. mira, mi mamá dice que vamos a aprovechar cuando vamos a ver al abuelo and do the piñata there. You know, oh. I, I used to cry, or or cut the cake in the. And, you know, I used to cry a lot. But I have I have some family that are Mexican, and I really love how Mexicans celebrate November 2. Absolutely. It's so cool. They really celebrate death. They paint themselves calaveras and everything. It's like, it's cool. Oh my God. Ese día los que cuidan los, los... Cementerios. Sí, se la, se la calan, man. Huh? Buena comida. Yeah, because the tradition is like you have to take something to the dead person. Yeah. So if that dead person really loved tequila, they take the bottle of tequila. Se la ponen en la tumba. Oops. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Or, or the food they like. You know, wow. wow. Yes. There's this video that makes me cry because I think, I don't know, but I saw it last year. That if you don't cry, is you don't have heart. This person, I don't know, there was in a, in a tomb, and he saw a man in the other, in the other side. It was it was only the man, and he was with a guitar, and he was singing to his wife. Oh, but he was singing this very beautiful song. But he was alone, and you can hear the woman crying, and the song was very beautiful. I always look for that video and I can't find it in YouTube because people take mariachis and this, but this man, he had like a, a very good voice and he was singing to his wife. Y la canción decía algo así, me parte el alma, me duele porque como te amo, te extraño. You know, like, it's like, wow. Oops. It's yes. If you don't cry, you have no heart. <laughs> okay, let's listen to the story. Mom? When did you get your first car? Can you hear? Well, by the time I was a junior in high school, I had gotten a part-time yes, job so that I could buy a used car. You can hear, right? Yes. Okay. Yes, okay. okay. Yes, One. Mom, when did you get your first car? Well, by the time I was a junior in high school, I had gotten a part-time job so that I could buy a used car. But you won't let me get a part-time job. I know, but before I got my first job, I was really immature. You know, I should have spent more time trying to get good grades instead of trying to get a car. You didn't get good grades? Well, I almost didn't graduate at the end of my senior year. Luckily, a school counselor noticed what was happening. He said I'd be able to buy any kind of car I wanted after I finished college and got a good-paying job. So he helped you get your priorities straight. Yes. A diploma was more important than a car. Yeah. Two. <laughs> now I understand why you won't let me get a job. Good. That's my boy. However, I'm still interested in hearing about what else you did or didn't do in high school. Do you have any other regrets? Well, if I'd been more serious about school, I wouldn't have taken classes like theater production. I should have taken more college-required classes. Do you mean like higher math classes? Exactly. And that's why I'm so concerned about the courses you choose. I want you to have no regrets when you graduate next year. Three. Gosh, Tess. Have you noticed how many coffee shops there are around campus these days? Well, Austin, there are at least five, and each one has a different atmosphere, lighting, furnishings. I don't know how they all stay in business. It sounds normal to me. In order to be successful, it's important to have all those things, plus great drinks and snacks. And it has to be different from the rest. I guess you're right. And don't forget good music. Yes, I agree. There's one place I like best. It's called Jazzy's, and they only play jazz music. And you like that? Sure. It's my favorite kind of music to study by. Four. How about you, Tess? Where do you go? Me? 
Well, I love the roasted bean because I always get a perfect latte. The roasted bean? Where's that? On College Avenue. It's the most popular coffee bar near campus because of its great mix of music. The most popular, huh? Yeah. And for it to stay that way, it needs to attract new customers. So let's go and I'll buy you a coffee, Austin. Uh, thanks, Tess, but I don't drink coffee. But you were... Okay, chai tea then. Let's go. Chai tea. Do you know what chai tea is? Yes, I know, teacher. In Buen Salvadoreño, in Buen Salvadoreño, what is chai tea? The chino. The chai. The chang. Fresco de chang. Fresco de chang. Yes. That is his name, chia. 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 Yeah. But remember, like in comedores, like, give me fresco de chang. <laughs> yeah, that's... I saw a meme, a meme that said like, "En su casa, no, en su, en su barrio pobre, deme una cora de chang." Pero cuando pagan con su un tai chi, please, <laughs> something like that. I, I yeah. un chai, un tai chai, yes. <laughs> So listen, before Patrick's mom finished high school, she almost didn't, didn't, didn't graduate. graduate. She almost didn't graduate. Good. If Patrick's mom had been more serious in high school, she would have taken higher, higher level classes. classes. To establish a po uh, popular coffee bar, Tess and Austin agree it's important to play, play, good, music. Music. play, play good, music. good music. Play good, play good music. music. Austin surprises Tess by saying he doesn't drink coffee. Doesn't drink coffee. Very good. Let's listen to part two. One. Okay, Ben, I think everything is ready for the party. What time did you tell everyone to show up? Oh, around 7.30 or 8. Great. Are Ellen and Walter coming? Well, I guess so. I sent Walter a text. Oh, no. Walter never checks his phone. You should have talked to him. I didn't really think about it. Texting is just more convenient for me. But you work with Ellen. You could have invited her at work. I'm sorry. I thought Walter would read the text message. I'm going to try to call them right now. Two. You know, Regina, I'm really fed up with Jessica. Why is that? She seems like a pretty nice person. In fact, I really enjoy working with her. She tells entertaining stories. Well, she does everything she can to impress the vice president. She's so polite to him, and she even baked him a chocolate cake on his birthday. Oh, I certainly wouldn't have done that. I think she's trying to get a promotion. Hmm, that's a very big assumption, Martin. Don't forget that she's nice to everyone, not just our boss. Ellen and Walter probably won't be at the party because... Ben sent a text message to Walter. Text message to Walter. Good. Martin thinks that Jessica should ha shouldn't have baked their boss. Baked their boss. Baked their boss. Their boss a birthday cake. Baked their boss a birthday cake. Ah. Mm. Yeah. All right, we got them all right. All right, choose the correct word. So we have, oh, we have many examples, 11. I will start with the first person I see, who is Janet. Yes, teacher. Janet, can you do number one? And then you choose the second person, please. 
So let me do that. Excuse me, what is this called? Once. No, no, Once. The, the, in computer language, okay. this box, what is it called? Um, options box, I don't know. Very good, oh. it's good, good, um, good try. Good try. Intento. good try. It's called, it's called drop down box. Okay. Drop down box. Y les digo porque hasta en, de hecho ya mm -hmm. se oye en español esa palabra. Okay. Le vamos a mandar, ahí está, ahí, le vamos a mandar en archivo y ahí va a haber un drop down. <laughs> ya, ya, gente ya lo hizo. Drop down. Down. Yeah, because you drop, <laughs> drop down. 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 Drop okay. down. Also, also, scrolling bar. Excuse me? Also, scrolling bar. No, 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 they say, people say, use a bar. Yes, but it's more pop, it's more common to say drop down. Yes, drop. yes, in this case, of course, yes. Mm -hmm. Y de verdad, ya van a oír gente, en el archivo va a ir un drop down, ahí va a poder poner. Y you know, dice, oh, okay, que es un drop down. So it's this. <laughs> this is a drop down. <laughs> no, but it makes sense. You know, you know, that's one thing I love about English. English is, is, is a very easy language compared to Spanish. Spanish is extremely complicated. Yes, it is. But English, everything makes sense. ¿Saben cómo se dice semáforo en inglés? Traffic light. Traffic light. Uh -huh. Y si no semáforo. saben, si no saben, le sacan lógica. Traffic light. Hmm. Traffic, tráfico, luz, luz. Ah, quizás es semáforo, right? But it makes sense. It's true. Uh -huh. But in, in Spanish, semáforos, like, por eso los gringos se ponen a analizar la palabra, like, hmm. <laughs> Okay. Semáforo. <laughs> Sem, from semi, foro, no, I, foro, it's a big room, un foro. I don't know, what is semáforo? It's a traffic light. Really? <laughs> yes. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Uh huh. Yeah, Spanish is just like. <laughs> okay, so Janet, do number one, please. Let me do the drop down. Yeah. Once I graduated from college, I used my college degree to get a high-paying job. Very good. I like the pronunciation. Very, very clear. Good. All right. Choose number two. Uh, you choose who you want the second one to be. Mm, Walter. Okay. Hey Beto, in that video, in that video, you look like the like a video from a salsa singer. A salsa singer. Yeah, you know the salsa singers. I'm a rock singer. Yeah. All right. I, I'm sorry. So, Jeanette, who is number two? Walter. Walter. Number two, Walter. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Okay. Uh, the moment they take you to talk you. I don't know how to say that. I would say Takio. Takio. Okay. The moment Takio got his first car, he nearly found out how many of his friends needed rides. Okay, good. All right. Can you say it again, please? Okay. The moment moment Takio got his first car, he immediately found out how many of the friend needed rice. Very good. Very good. Good pronunciation, good fluency. ¿Sabe cuál es su próximo paso? Okay. Yeah. Leer, leer la ortografía. Uh, like you yeah. see the comma? No, you did it very good. Yeah. Y por el hecho yeah. que lo hizo bien, le aconsejo que se vaya a su siguiente paso. For example, there's a okay. comma, right? So you can say, the momio, I'm sorry, the momio. <laughs> the moment <laughs> Akio got his first car, he immediately found out how many of his friends needed ride. You know, 
So yeah. that you know, that's a better way to practice. A veces hay mucha gente okay. en español también no leemos la caligrafía. A veces. I'm, I'm sorry, es caligrafía, right? Más. Uh -huh. o, yeah. orto, no, ortografía. No, ortografía. Ortografía, I'm sorry, yes. Uh -huh. yeah. All right, Walter Ramos, choose number three, please. Okay. Go, Javier Martinez. Hey. Beto. Let me see the drop down box. <laughs> All right, good. Let me see the drop down box. I Please. like that. Uh, um, as soon as Katrina landed his first job, she had decided to put 10% of each paycheck in the bank. You said one word. Had decided. Decided. She decided. You said as soon as Katrina landed his first job. Her, her sorry. No her problem. first job, she decided to put 10% of each paycheck in the bank. All right, cool. Next, number four, please. I don't know. Let me see how long. Blanca Natalia de la Trinidad. Hi. <laughs> Falta uno. Yeah. Uh, Rios. Yeah. Berrio, yeah. Verdugo. Verdugo, I'm sorry. <laughs> you make me made a mistake. What is your email? <laughs> Don't tell me your email is Blanca. Can you imagine? Blanca Natalia no. La Trinidad. No, no, it's not. <laughs> BN Montes. Okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You know how I talk to doctors every day? They always tell me, why so many names? Because all Latinos, like, can I have the patient's name? Si me podría decir su nombre. Blanca Estela, or like, Blanca Estela Elizabeth de Calderón Lopez. Mm -hmm. And I have to tell them, Blanca Estela Elizabeth de Calderón Lopez. Okay. Como yo se lo van, Joe Smith. Mm -hmm. <laughs> all right. Okay. Do number four, please. Okay. To gain more more real world experience in college, Andres should have applied for a non paying internship. Should have applied. Very good. Number five. Uh, uh, I don't have the names, but uh, let me help you. You have Amilcar, you have Sandra, you have Miguel. Okay, you, Miguel. And oh, let me open my box. You have Jacqueline, Roberto Adonai, Daniel, you have Carl. Oh, you said Miguel already, right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, go, Miguel. <laughs> okay. The number five, right? No. Oh, yeah. No. Yes, yes. I don't know. Yeah. If I'd been more sensitive in college, I could have learned how control my money and not get into debt. Dip? Debt. Debt. All right, can you read it again, please? Okay. If I'd been more sensitive in a college, I could have learned how to control my money and not get into debt. Very good. It's sensible. Sensible. Okay, now repeat. Very good. I like that. Good pronunciation. Now do this. If I've been, repeat. If I've been more sensible in college, more sensible in college, I could have learned. I could have learned how to control my money and not get into debt. How to control my money and not get into debt. Good. So when it's very long, say it in parts. If it's necessary, okay. say it in five. If you still think it's a little difficult, continue in five. When you get more fluency, say it in four, in three, in two. Hasta que lo digamos. If I've been more sensible in college, I could have learned how to control my money and not get into debt. Then you did it. This is something like caer en mora, verdad? Debt, yes. Oh, this is for you because in your line of business, this is a good vocabulary for you, Deb. Yeah, I write it. <laughs> All right. 
Miguel, choose number six. Um, Jacqueline? Yes. Yes, teacher. All right, go ahead. Number okay. Six. Number six, teacher. Yes, Let please. The drop down box. Please. Thank you. I wanted, I, that's what I wanted to hear. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> he shouldn't have been so naive. I can't believe he actually failed for, the, for all of the lies Anna told him. Naive. Naive. The Naive. president? Oh. Ironically, it's the same pronunciation. <laughs> naive. He shouldn't have been so naive. naive. Do, you know, do you know what naive is? Uh, in Geno? No, he's the president uh, of El Salvador. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's in Genoa or in Genoa. Mm -hmm. Dundo. Perdón. No. Yeah. I, I, uh, uh, depends, yes. Dumb. Is that goofy? <laughs> no, no, no. Naive is like. Credulo. Yeah, it's in Genoa. Like, you know, like children are very naive. They believe everything. Mm, and yeah. silly? Women are very naive. They, oh, well, men too. We are very naive. We believe everything women no say sometimes. Not silly. No, but you know, sometimes women. Something like silly? No, it's not. I mean, naive is something like innocentemente pueden caer en una trampa, you know? Mm. Naive is like when you believe somebody and that they're lying. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's like, te lo juro que no era yo. En serio, mi amor. Júramelo, te lo juro. Okay, I believe you. That's naive. <laughs> Si te vienen a contar cositas malas de mí. Yes. Hoy con WhatsApp y, y, y tele, pictures on the telephone is very difficult. Ahí no hay de otra. But like 20 years ago, it was cool because, really? O sea, you believe your friend and not me? No, I believe you. <laughs> All right, let's do number seven together. If, let me do the drop down. If blank, so mature, I would have appreciated all that my family tried to do for me when I was in school. If I, I hadn't, hadn't, been, hadn't, hadn't been, hadn't been, hadn't been, hadn't been. Hadn't you know what immature is, right? Immature. Yeah. yeah. Immaduro. Yes. Immaduro. Number eight, the delivery man was supposed to drop off the boxes at nine o'clock. He's an hour late. He might have. He might have lost the directions to get here. Uh, ¿Quién me dijo drop off today? I think it was, it was you, huh, Sandra? Drop off? No, the last topographer I said. Okay. Stop over. Stop over. Know. I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, number nine. Gloria was wearing a new, um, a new ring today, and John looked very happy. They blank decided to get married. Must have. Must have. Must have. Must have. Yes. Must, must have is a conclusion, right? Number 10, did you remember to chain to blah, the did, did you charge. remember to charge the digital camera? Oh no. You I should have. have. You should have, have reminded me. You should have reminded me. I ordered steak last night at the new restaurant. I was disappointed. It was undercooked. But I didn't do anything about it. I would have. Would have. Would have. Would have. Yes. Jacqueline. Have. I should have. I'm sorry. Yes, it's correct. Yes, Jacqueline, sure. what is undercooked? Excuse me, teacher. Can you repeat me, please? Sh sure. What is undercooked? Undercooked. Mm, recocido. No, the contrary. 
<risa> Crudo. <risa> Mal cocido. Right? Medio fuego. Medium crudo. <risa> yes, undercooked es. <risa> ya, yeah, aún está algo crudo. Sí, ¿cuál sería esa palabra? Está muy cocido. Término medio. Término medio. Oh, ah, pero... teacher. Oh, quedó falto. No, pero es que los términos solo son en carnes, pero. Uh -huh. Medium. Pero, pero, por ejemplo, hay, hay huevos. Eh, excuse me, my, tibio. my egg is under tibio. 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 Yes, but under, undercooked es como, es, no ha llegado al punto, al punto de your de satisfaction. No ha llegado al punto. Of your satisfaction. Uh -huh. No está en su punto. Ajá, es ahí, por ejemplo, una vez comí una sopa de pollo, me, I remember, y cuando mordí el pollo en la sopa estaba bien rojo, like, ah, oh. no, no, no. I don't know if it's psychological, but after that day, I have never eaten my chicken in the soup. <laughs> I, I, I love chicken soup, but I like the chicken separate, mm -hmm. fried or something. Right. Yes. Uh, can you see my screen in this moment? Yes. yes teacher. What yes, teacher. do you yes, see? Teacher. What do you see? The sky. The, sky, the, sky, the, the firmament. Google. You see Google, the Google page, yeah. right? Google. Google. Yes. Okay, look, I will, I will recommend you. Do you see this? Yes. Google's yes. afraid. Yes. Okay, yes. this is the translate. Le voy a enseñar algo. Yeah. Let me see, let me, let me think of something. YouTube. Teacher, I use the, the dictionary. No, but okay, do you see, do you see this right now? Yes. 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 It's in English, right? It's, sure. it's a web page. It's in English. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what you do is you click mm -hmm. on the link. You come to Google Translate. Even though there is a website. Mm -hmm. yes. Yes. Yep. yes. You put the link. Yeah. And now it's in Spanish. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Mm. Mm. Nice. Okay. It's a very it's a cool. Yeah, it's if you ever you know, if you ever don't understand something, you go, oh, what is a key? Look, documents, text, or website. Yes. Mm -hmm. Esta esta herramienta es la que yo uso más. Hay bastante, pero Google Translate is the best. Yes. Okay. okay. Thank you, teacher. You are, for example, look, mm -hmm. booster, esfuerzo, inyección, esto se usa bastante in my, in my job. Like, yeah, ya se pusieron el booster. <laughs> you, what the hell is booster? Y es la, la <laughs> vacuna de refuerzo. Refuerzo. Booster. Mm -hmm. And then it tells you here, look, it's a noun, the, the types, mm -hmm. but it's, I, I recommend you because 90% 95% accurate. Pero me gusta también el hecho del website. Website. Mm -hmm. Entonces, yes. But uh, when I I enter uh, in in any websites, we can select the the language. Sometimes. Sometimes. Yes, sometimes. If the website has that. Okay. But if the website doesn't have that, copy the link. Go to Google Translate and put the link on the a link. Okay. And it will immediately do it. All right? Good. Sometimes, sometimes I use the Cambridge Dictionary. It's good. It's good, but I... I I don't know, it's like, como dicen, uno se casa con, con la marca o con el, con lo que se acostumbra. You know? Yeah, I know. Es como like Android or Android or, or iPhone. iPhone. iOS. 
Uh, I, I, you know, both are good, but I would recommend Android because I only use Android. But I know iPhone is excellent too, and some people use iPhone. Okay, so thank you very much, class. Have a very good weekend. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye bye. Enjoy. Yeah. Bye bye. Don't drink bye. too much. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're Anything. right. A couple oh, beers. <laughs> yes. See you. Have a nice weekend, guys. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.